Hey, everybody, welcome back inside the State Champs Sports Network studios. We're giving you an update in this week's State Champs Top 25 rankings. And to do that, we always need the man, Scott Bernstein, to provide it. It's his insight. It's his rankings. Working with State Champs that you get to see every Monday at statechampsnetwork.com. Okay, we're going to talk two teams. Number one, a team that has now made it into the rankings. They made a little noise on the internet talking about uh, we feel we should be in there. Talking about Grand Rapids Catholic Central. Heading into, and they're a unique team. Interesting that uh, we're talking about them now. So last year, of course, heading into the season, the three-time defending Division Five State They've Champs. They've five of the last seven. Right actually had a loss in the regular season to Grand Rapids South Christian. Couldn't believe they lost. It was a great game. Of course, South Christian went on to win the D4 state championship, so no love lost there. GRCC loses to Gladwin in the semifinals. Then they lose the opener big to a team from Illinois who was also a state champion. So, is the run over for CC, we're saying, not so fast. Beat River Rouge by 32 points in week two. Haven't looked back. Yeah, that was a real statement uh, game coming back to Michigan, trucking a River Rouge team that had just, you know, put a scare into Belleville. Absolutely. Um, lost on the last play of the game. But, uh, you know, that was their, you know, well, welcome to 2023. We haven't gone anywhere. Right. We might have had a little dip in that opener yeah. uh, in, in Illinois, but we're still going to be, you know, contending for another state championship. That's the expectation. Uh, you know, they're one of the premier programs really in MHSA history for what they've been able for to sure. do no uh, doubt. in terms of racking up state championships. This year, they got a, a triple threat that has really kind of underrated uh, quarterback Connor Wolf. Uh, you know, I call him the professor because he's just schooling people out there. He's also, you know, he's one of the he, he's also a candy man because he's dropping dimes. Of course. But uh, I love what I what I see from Connor Wolf. Just a lot of poise and precision in the pocket. Kellen. Russell Dixon uh, at the running back spot, and then Jamie Williams at the wide receiver. Uh, they are just, uh, you know, going gangbusters offensively. You know, I, I just got him in this uh, this past week at 25. I think there's a good chance they could move up uh, as the weeks go on. I just wanted to see a little bit more after those first two weeks, but there's no question that Grand Rapids Catholic Central is, you know, still at peak GRCC performance in 23, and I expect uh, those triplets that I just uh, referenced to keep on piling up wins, piling up stats, and, and maintaining that great standard of excellence that is Grand Rapids Catholic Absolutely. We're going to move to our number 20 team right now, which is Grand Ledge. Now, this is a team that is 4-0 for the second time in three years. Lost in the regionals to Mason McKenzie in Caledonia a year ago. 155 points in the first four games. Close call last week versus Lansing Waverly, but they got the win. Yeah, they won in overtime. Uh, this is a team that I don't think a lot of people thought very highly of to start the year. I'm the only one, I think, that, that ranked them uh, in, in my top 25, but I'm Happy the definitive to, rankings. But I'm happy to see over the last couple of weeks some of the other major outlets have started to, you know, uh, have that come to Jesus moment that Grand Ledge is is for real again, just like they were last year. And uh, a lot of that comes from the fact that, you know, they had to replace a quarterback. Jamison Patton moved from wide receiver to quarterback, and he is just as steady as they can be in his new position. Uh, they got a lot of gritty, tough runners. Mac Foreman is the guy that I want to throw out there as uh, the guy that I've been really impressed with rushing the football. Hey, we will feature Grand Ledge and do it next week as one of our Game Time Live broadcasts this season. You can catch all the action Friday night at 7 p.m. on the State Champs Sports Network YouTube page uh, as these two rivals will go at it. So, and you can check out State Champs Top 25 rankings updated every Monday at statechampsnetwork.com. Just click on the rankings tab.